This local sports report is presented by the Cobblestone Public House, a proud supporter of the Paris Mounties. Cobblestone is located at 111 Grand River Street North in downtown Paris and offers an unforgettable dining experience. They provide a laid-back atmosphere, serving gourmet versions of pub favorites. Drop by for dinner, order takeout or get delivery. Check out the menu at cobblestonepub.ca. The Paris Mounties looking to pull off an upset as they hit the ice on Saturday night. The Mounties hosting Kyle Baker and the second place Wellesley Applejacks at the Brand Sports Complex. Opening period is a good chance for the Jacks. Connor Dorbecker to Kyle Baker. His shot is turned away by Nick Barker. He keeps the game scoreless. Then we've got a big hit on the near side. Isaiah Katsubi for Wellesley leveling Brady McLaren. Still in the first, the Mounties strike on this play. Grant Eastwood setting up Brett Hibbert and he puts it in. Hibbert with his fourth goal of the season. The Mounties up 1-0 after 20 minutes. Second period, here comes Wellesley. This is Connor Dorbecker breaking in and it's a bullet from Dorbecker. He ties the game with his second of the season. We are not at out one. A few minutes later, this time Dorbecker is dishing. He finds Carson Wickey who turns and fires. Nick Barker with the stop. He gobbles it up and we stay tied. Midway through the period, Paris with a three on one. Xavier Moore to Aiden Switzer and he buries it. Sensational from Switzer. He puts the Mounties back on top. It's 2-1. Later watch the far boards. Austin Stemler coming over and he drills Owen Switzer in front of the Mounties bench. Back to the highlights in a minute. First, a reminder, this video is presented by the Cobblestone Pub, a proud supporter of the Mounties. Drop by before or after the game at 111 Grand River Street North in Paris. Still in the second, the Jacks with a man advantage. Isaiah Katsubi is at the near point. His shot off a stick into the net. Wellesley is back on even terms. It's 2-2. Back come the Mounties, and it's another goal for Aiden Switzer. He's having a night. Switzer with a power play mark. Paris is up 3-2 after two periods. Let's move to the third. Sam Collins in the middle. Hey, Sam, why don't you go ahead and give us a wire job? What a shot from Collins. He extends the lead. Paris is up by a pair. It's 4-2. And from there, Nick Barker was unbeatable. He stops Jake LaRue on this play. Barker with 38 saves. And it's a Mounties victory. They take it by a final score of 4-2. Aiden Switzer the scoring star with two goals for the Mounties. Nice, you know, it's nice to get a big upset win against the second place team. Might be the team we play in the finals or the first round of the playoffs. So yeah, it's nice. And it's finally nice to bury a few goals, get the monkey off my back. We've been coming along right. We've been peaking. We've been uh, putting the work in at practice. We've been, uh, yeah, we've been going in the right direction. It's like really huge for us moving forward in the playoffs and uh, to beat them. Uh, we're probably going to see him first round unless we start going up on this uptrend. But for me, I think in that second period, the boys really helped me out. And if it wasn't for them, you know, I couldn't have done it. Parker played absolutely unreal. That game has to go to him. He kept us in it. He said we kept him in it, but he kept us right in it. As of right now, if we were to go into playoffs, we'd be playing them. So I think that's pretty good. We know that we can beat them. They know we can beat them.